take a look, uh, look at our metrics, uh, look at our peers, look what they've done. Uh, they've done exceptionally well. Lithium is not only strong now, but it's going to get stronger in 2022. Joining us for a conversation is Peter Ball, the president of Norum Lithium. Mr. Ball, welcome to the show, sir. Hello, Maurice. How are you? Nice to see you again. <laughs> it's a great time to be speaking with you as Norm Lithium has just announced its most significant milestone to date, the release of its robust preliminary economic assessment on the high-grade Zeus Lithium project located in Nevada. Let's find out how Norm Lithium is positioning shareholders as a force in the green energy revolution. Mr. Ball, please introduce us to Norm Lithium and the unique opportunity the company presents to shareholders. Yeah, thanks, Maurice. Um, Norum Lithium is a Canadian advanced exploration and development company focused on our Zeus uh, Lithium project in Nevada, in the Clayton Valley, Nevada. We trade on the TSX under the symbol NRM uh, and in the United States under NRVTF. Um, and most recently, we just announced our preliminary economic assessment. So it's a, probably one of the biggest weeks in our corporate history. <laughs> well, before we get into the exciting details of the PA, Mr. Ball, take us to the Clayton Valley of Nevada and briefly acquaint us with your flagship Zeus Lithium Project strategic location, neighbors, and quick facts. So the Zeus Project is located uh, halfway between Las Vegas and Reno. So if you head out of Las Vegas, about three hours just off the highway, um, there's an area and probably one of the most um, kind of aggressively explored and now becoming the most uh, uh, developed area is Clayton Valley. Um, the Aber, Abermarle Lithium Brine uh, Mine, which is the only lithium project in the United States of America, it's been operating for about 60 years, um, uh, is uh, the project that's been operating in Clayton Valley. And right next door to them is NORAM, ourselves, which we've been advancing the project for about five years with a number of ex uh, drill programs, a uh, couple of metallurgical studies. Uh, we built three different and updated and upgraded resource um, models, identifying a very significantly large uh, lithium uh, carbonate uh, in Clay's project. So in the area, not only ourselves is it a, a, another company right next to us, uh, which is called Cypress Development. They're in the PFS stage. Um, they have a market cap of $250 million. Again, we're right next door and we'll talk about it a little bit later, but our PEA numbers are actually nearly, uh, actually probably better than uh, Cypress next door. About 40 miles away, there's another company focused on another lithium carbonate project called Ioneer on their Rhyolite Ridge project. They're a billion dollar market cap. So they're, again, they're a little bit more advanced. They're heading into production or construction 2022. And another one to point out again in Nevada is Lithium Americas, which is about 260 miles north of our, ourselves. Their market cap, I, I believe recently is about 5 billion. So they've been doing a lot of work advancing another lithium carbonate in clays. It's this smectite illite clay formation where the lithium, uh, where we are is actually uh, leached out of the brine uh, mine next door and come into our project. Talk about the ideal location here. You're in a great neighborhood in arguably the best mining jurisdiction in the world. And to top Absolutely. things off, uh, Norm Lithium has just released a very robust PEA on the Zeus project, establishing Norm among limited peers as the newest low-cost, high-grade, near-term lithium producer in North America. Sir, please walk us through the highlights of your PEA. First of all, I think what we need to look at is um, you know, the projects that are going to be advanced uh, going forward over the next few years are the ones that have the best economics, the ones that have the fastest payback period, the lowest capex, and the opportunity to provide uh, a significant uh, NPV at an 8% discount um, and a long mining life. So if we focus in specifically on um, our Zeus project, at, uh, so actually let's talk about the price of lithium first, lithium carbonate. Uh, recently this last week, it's been trading at $28,500 per ton. So that's the, that's the number where it's trading. The long-term forecast is 14,000. So if we dive into the PEA, our metrics, 
at only $9,500 a ton is about $1.3 billion uh, NPV at 8% uh, discount. Internal rate of return is 31%. Uh, we're using 9,500 in the base case. Our recovery is uh, 89, 90%. Our costs are about 33.55 per ton. So we're actually in the lower decile or the lowest. If you put ourselves, look, look at our corporate presentation, you see that we're actually probably one going to be, uh, when this gets to production, one of the lowest cost producers, uh, not only in Nevada, but nearly globally as you put this, this forward. 40 year mine life, 17,000 tons per day. The gross revenue over the 40 year mine life is $12.2 billion. So touching on that quickly, if, 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 um, if listeners take a look at our neighbor, Cyprus, and you go to our presentation, we put our numbers side by side. Let's compare apples to apples. They're at the PFS stage, a little bit ahead of us. By about six months, their market cap is 250, we're 70. Take a look side by side. Our numbers actually beat them uh, on on every line item, so it's great, uh, great numbers for for Nora. Well, what really impresses me as well as the conservative approach of ninety five hundred. You know, just looking at those numbers, if you were at the the long term projected numbers, estimated numbers of fourteen thousand, again that puts you in the the uh, market cap of two hundred twenty million. Yeah, I mean that's a great point, Maurice. If if you look at um, the uh, the NPV of, of, of Zeus using the long-term forecast from all the banks, from all the groups in the lithium market, they're forecasting 14,000. If we run our numbers, which is actually in our PEA, our NPV is 2.7 billion with an internal rate of return of 52 or 53%. If the numbers increase a little bit, we ran them for fun. You know, if this thing, stick, <laughs> if the price um, hovers around $25,000, our market cap is is in the range of five to six billion. So incredible numbers. The metrics they've got to be low to allow a project like this to move forward. And we've got some of the best numbers. Talk about a unique value proposition, and it couldn't have come at a better time as the United States has just declared lithium as a critical mineral. Absolutely. I mean, you know, the race for the supply crunch that's going to happen in 2025 onwards to 2000 upwards to 2040 as this you know, the, the EV revolution or the, the, the green race in, in America, um, the only mine that's been operating in the United States is right next to us. And, and they've actually just announced in January of this year that they're doubling their production by 2025. So they're on the race to supply um, the developers in the United States. And with uh, uh, Tesla's Gigafactory just up the road in Nevada, Nevada is now number three in resources in, in the lithium market next to Argentina and Bolivia. Now, I did reference that you are in the ideal location, did I not? <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> All right. Any better. <laughs> Switching gears, let's look at some numbers. Mr. Ball, please provide us with the capital structure for Norm Lithium. Yeah, you know, this this also very unique. You need, in order for a company to get a re-rate or an opportunity for our shareholders, to have that win for where we are trading today. So we're a $70 million market cap. We have 75 million shares up. Our neighbor has 130. They have a market cap of uh, 250. They're trading at $1.95 this morning. So with 75 million shares out, our largest shareholder, our, our chief executive officer, um, which is you know one of the reasons I looked before I ever joined a company, largest shareholder, he doesn't even draw a salary, never sold a share. He sees the value of not only where we are now, because he's been here as the founder since day one, uh, grabbed the projects, drilled every single hole, that's put this resource together. Uh, and also our chairman, uh, Anita, Anita Angie, she's also another significant large share, a large, uh, large shareholder of the company. Um, so you got management putting their dollars in, not selling them. Um, and again, with the, the board of directors alongside, we do have some uh, warrants trading uh, that will be exercisable at 96, so right about where we are now. We keep coming up, building a base, and continuing upwards. Um, and those are have a forced conversion at $1.10. So that would bring in another $3 million. We have about two and a half. Uh, that together, uh, as we advance in the, into next year, uh, we're financed, we're full, fully financed. In closing, Mr. Ball, what would you like to say to shareholders? 
Uh, I encourage shareholders to take a look, uh, look at our metrics, uh, look at our peers, look what they've done. Uh, they've done exceptionally well. Lithium is not only strong now, but it's going to get stronger in 2022. Um, the metrics is key for which project will get to the next level. 2022 will be our biggest year again. Uh, again, in Q1, we're doing a drill program. That's going to take some of the 175 million additional resources in the inferred category, place them into the indicated category. We're going to use that in our uh, PFS next year. So we'll also, again, like I just said, we'll complete a pre-feasibility study next year. And this is just, you know, executing on a strategy of, of de-risking the asset, um, which will deliver, we think, um, a good win for the shareholders as they follow along. And, you know, like I've told a few of my colleagues, if you own, you know, some of these other companies that are trading at $5, $3, you got to own us at 96 cents because we're going there. Mr. Ball, for someone listening that wants to get more information on Norm Lithium, please share the contact details. Yeah, Noram, N-O-R-A-M, lithiumcorp.com. You can sign up there. I think at the back of the presentation on the website is my direct cell phone. You can email me at my email on the last page of the presentation. If you phone me, I'll get back to you within the day, 100% guarantee. Um, and it's good. Phone the management, see what we're doing, see what, what we're going to execute and follow along. Um, put us on your radar. I can be fun. I can vouch for that. When you call Mr. Ball, he will return your call if he doesn't pick up immediately. <laughs> Absolutely, Maurice. All right. Mr. Ball, always a pleasure speaking with you. Wishing you and Norm Lithium the absolute best, sir. The information presented on Proven and Probable is provided for educational and informational purposes only, without any express or implied warranty of any kind, including warranties of accuracy, completeness, or fitness for any particular purpose. The information is not intended to be and does not constitute financial, investment, or trading advice, or any other advice. You should not make any financial, investment, or trading decision based on any of the information presented without first undertaking independent due diligence and consultation with a professional broker or competent financial advisor.